Hello, it's Tuesday the 24th. I'm FX Blue and this is the Market Brief. Now, the Labour Party conference is on at the moment. Um, a vote on the winter fuel allowance was postponed until Wednesday, but by then many, including the Prime Minister, will have already left. Starmer is heading to New York for the UN General Assembly, uh, no doubt to discuss the war in Ukraine and the escalations in the Middle East. Ahead of her first budget, though, Chancellor Reeves was positive and upbeat. She promised that sacrifices now will lead to benefits further down the road, but she did promise there would be no return to austerity. Governor Bailey has been on. He has reiterated that the rate cut cycle will be gradual and proportionate. Although the economy is likely to post a third consecutive month of zero growth, concerns remained around inflation and that is what motivated the MPC to leave rates unchanged last week. Over in the US, some market commentators believe the Fed is avoiding facing up to the true state of the economy, which is being masked by consumer activity. Inflation has cooled from historic highs without a recession so far, and unemployment, the unemployment rate is at the sweet spot. The Fed's challenge, of course, is to keep it all balanced, and that may need another couple of rate cuts before year end. Broadly, the 50 basis point rate cut has been accepted as justified, but broader market sentiment does not expect another jumbo rate cut this year, unless the economy tanks or job creation drops like a stone. The market is still digesting the rate cut. Sterling is supported by the economic woes on the continent, which may force the ECB to cut rates significantly. And a further 50 basis points of cuts, which are expected from the Fed before year end, um, is helping balance things while the Bank of England remains concerned over the risk of inflation. All that points to the interest rate differential being set to grow in the favour of the UK. Sterling peaked around 133.60 against the dollar yesterday and we broke 120 against the euro for the first time since April 2022. Go on the pound. We kick off this morning around 133.50 against the dollar, 120.15 against the euro and euro dollar is around 111.15 on the open. That's it from me. Have a great day. If you do not have a clue then just tweet through and ask FX Blue.